Hey guys, welcome to today's MCAT question of the day. As always, we will be working our way through one of the mini MCAT practice problems found at MCATselfprep.com, the home of the free MCAT prep course. I'm Andrew George, a 99th percentile MCAT tutor, and I will be walking you through today's practice problem as if you are one of my private tutoring students. Be sure to hit pause and try this problem for yourself before watching my explanation. In understanding retroviruses, I think it's important to memorize the mechanism of action for HIV as depicted here. Let's go ahead and walk through this diagram step by step, starting with this initial step right here. In this step, proteins on the envelope of HIV will bind to a receptor on the host cell. From there, the virus will release its contents into the host cell. The most important of these contents is the viral RNA. This contains the genetic information of HIV that will then be used to program all the viruses that it's going to result in the production of. From here, reverse transcriptase, the first of the important proteins, is going to convert viral RNA into viral DNA. And this viral DNA can be inserted directly into the host's genome. And this is done via the second important protein of HIV, integrase. From there, the host's machinery can transcribe all the DNA into viral mRNA, which will then be translated by the host's machinery into the proteins that make up HIV. These will then be packaged into a budding HIV. From there, the virus will mature, and one of the ways in which it matures is through protease, the third important protein of HIV, which will clip the connections between these proteins, resulting in proteins that are separated, as seen over here. Because these proteins are now separated, they can do their job. And now they're ready to start the cycle all over again with step number one. So in summary, what are the three key proteins that HIV uses to do its job? Reverse transcriptase, integrase, and protease as stated here in answer choice D. If you enjoyed this question of the day, be sure to give it a like. And for more MCAT questions of the day, be sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel and enroll in our free MCAT prep course found at MCATselfprep.com. And if you are really looking to maximize your MCAT score, feel free to visit my tutoring profile page and request a free 10-minute phone consultation. I would love to chat with you about your situation and how you can maximize your MCAT score. I look forward to hearing from you soon. We'll see you next time.